Welcome to the Militia Gaming Community, I'm Trigger, and today I'm going to show you why I can't stop playing Trailmakers. Let's go! The Militia Gaming Community and Dave Loves Games came together to create a community Discord. If you'd like to join the Discord, there's an invite link in the description down below. I've been kind of bouncing around to different games lately, and I happened to stumble across a game called Trailmakers. Now this is not a new game, it actually came out quite a while ago, so if you're watching this and going, I saw this game last year, I'm sorry. But it's semi-new to Xbox Game Pass, it looked like a LEGO knockoff planet exploration builder, so I thought, ah, eh, let me give it a try. Turns out, it's so much more than that, but before I get into the juicy race parts, let me explain what it is at its core. The game's main feature is a vehicle builder in a world that features near real physics. You basically work to unlock parts so that you can build vehicles that suit your needs when it comes to salvaging more parts. The builder is basically an unrestricted Lego style builder and what I mean by that is that as long as it can snap together it will allow you to put whatever part wherever you want on the vehicle. Which means you can come up with some insane builds and designs. To do that though you need to progress through the campaign and find and salvage all of the parts scattered throughout the world. Hopefully I didn't lose you guys who came for the racing part because here's the thing. If you take that knowledge over to the drag race track which is on Race Island, you literally can build anything you want to make a pass. It is the ultimate freedom in terms of building a car to race your friends. There is a global leaderboard with thousands of players on it and once you make a pass the game fills the race with other random players that were close to your last time so you can try and beat them as well. I'm not kidding, I got stuck trying to make the fastest drag car I could from scratch. A friend of mine and I played this for literally 4 hours, just making a pass, revising the design, making a pass, revising the design, I could not stop. Because the physics is such a big part of the game, you have to pay close attention to making sure that your car's weight is distributed correctly, your blocks are symmetrical, and your power to weight ratio is high. Now there's obviously more to the game than just drag racing, there's actually a full campaign mode, but on Race Island alone, there's a circle track, an aerial race course, an underwater race, multiple boat races, and some monster truck racing. If the idea of building your own car from scratch sounds too time consuming though, you can add on or change the template designs, or just download someone else's design from the gallery and mod that. You can literally build anything from motorcycles to jet planes to submarines or whatever this is. I highly recommend checking this game out. It's available on PC, PS4, and is now part of the Xbox Game Pass library. I've had an insane amount of fun with this game in the last couple of days. I've probably sank 10 to 15 hours into this game. I can't stop playing it because I just keep changing my build to suit my needs. Anyways, this is just a short heads up for you guys today. Please go try Trailmakers and show me your builds. Send your builds to me on Instagram. Send them to me in the Discord. Send them to me on Twitter, however you want, but I'd love to check out some of your builds. Thank you so much for watching. Shout out to the militia as always. I will catch you on the next one. Trigger out.